They go here with a former Lion. It's I think that every member of that offense knows exactly where he sits. You can see it from every one of them out there. They're all fully committed to making this. He'll look to throw. Pass taken in by his big tight end. And up to the 35 before they're able to knock him down. The defense surrenders a 13-yard pass play there on Nowadays, 30. we hardly ever see anyone really run for it on short yardage, so they're going to throw the football more times than not. That was a nice, easy rhythm throw right there, and they pick up the first down. And he has a big gain inside. They'll look to throw here. Over the middle, and that's caught by Kamel. He's got room to roam, and he's going to get it all the way down to the Hoping to kind of get lost in the middle of the field. And this is put right on it, and he's able to pick up. And he takes this one in for a Bears touchdown. DeAndre Swift, his third rushing touchdown of the year. And the Bears get the upper hand. Stick game, but I think when it comes within your division like this, it's a measuring stick game with a little extra intrigue. I would agree with that totally because all division games have a little extra to them. It's not a make or break if this were, let's say, week 15, 16, somewhere in that neighborhood. Being chased out left. And he's just going to get rid of this thing to no one in the, the NFL in that department. One thing you do know, you know they'll be fired up because they're facing a top five rushing attack. And even if they have early success against them, or you are line. The play action fake. They'll look to throw. And he'll be hit as he releases it, and that'll fall incomplete. It affects their psyche because, let's face it, you work all summer pointing toward that opening game, you get the win, but then you don't carry it on from there. How do they bounce back from these losses? Third and five. He'll drop to throw. Flushed out right. And he will slide to a stop. He does have the first down. On first and ten, it's Swift. It's a six-yard pickup. Four. As they've got it as we resume action. They'll roll him out right. Oh, he's trying to force something there. He thought better of it, and that was the right decision. He's got his running back out of the backfield. And he's out of bounds right around the team. To get guys on the ground, we can live with that. But if you're going to give up 10, 12, 15 yards after the catch, then your defense is going to be a lot. Now a first carry for their fullback. And this won't be enough to pick up the first. Not for a win in the defense's column. Out of the gun now on third down. Got his man, and it's caught. Push a touchdown. DeAndre Swift. He scored on the ground and through the air. And the Bears go up by two touchdowns. Start to this game as these guys could have asked for, Charles. They've scored on their first two drives. They still haven't given anything up on the other side of the ball. So they can already make this. It's for me, which I know would excite all of our viewers, but you're just not supposed to see that type of dominance so quickly in a game like this. Everything they've done has been working so far. They'll look to throw. To hit and second and ten, he'll look to throw again. There's a short throw. It's caught by Kamel. And he's got out to the tight end. Now it gives him a much better opportunity to convert on third down. They'll try and run here with Swift. And he's got the first down. Yardage before being taken down. He made a turnover battle. And the second, third down conversions. So they got one there. He lets this one fly toward the back of the end zone. It's incomplete. Took a shot. Couldn't catch. On second down, Swift. Holding offense. You and Jonathan Coachman both larger than life. No doubt about it. But you're stuck with me in this booth. <laughs> yes, he's miles away and smiling. A long way to go here on third down for the eighth play of the drive. Back Talk to the it over, we step aside. On fourth down, the punt team is on as this is sent away. And a fair catch called for and made just outside the 15-yard line. At their own 20-yard line. 
They'll try and start this drive in the air. And he'll get this complete downfield to commit. And he'll take this to the other side of midfield before going out of bounds. Here, the protection, that's what made this play a success. Quarterback had to wait for his crossing route to develop, and that takes a little bit of extra time. And this is caught inside the five. A big play there just to finish now on first and goal. Back to throw. Escaping the pressure right. They go play action here on first down. He'll get that to play to his tight end Kamek. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. Swift going to try up the middle. He's going to go out of bounds, but he takes this one down just shy of the here for first and 10. Off the play fake, he'll look to throw. D.J. Moore, and he's brought down after a very nice game. A well executed. But they're going to be set up in great shape with first and goal. That's to Moore, and he's got it. Touchdown, Bears. A great effort there. His fifth touchdown now on the year. And the Bears take the well, opening. to go as they begin first and ten. They'll start on the ground with Swift. And for one of the few times here today, this run is yeah, not... The average he's got so far, that's the type of average he wants to take with him to contract negotiations, doesn't he? The throw over the middle, taken in. And he gets this one just shy of the 40 down at the third. He'll look to throw. Eluding the pressure right. This will be caught downfield by Moore. And he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. A really Might good have to start digging in our second half blowout material. They will run straight ahead with Swift. And they'll get him down after a pickup of eight. Mm -hmm. Seconds feel like he's one of them, and they really embrace him. That's complete right side to commit. It'll be a pickup of four. Good enough to run. Yeah. And was able to make the sure catch and flip the down marker back to one. Yeah, he's got it. Touchdown! Cole in from 21 yards away. And the Bears are able to extend their lead in the final seconds of this third As this offense takes over first and ten. This is Swift on the counter. And some solid footwork there as he'll take this down to about the 30. They've been satisfied with what he's given them. Whenever they've needed a big run, a first down, he's the guy they've turned to. And it doesn't matter what the defense thinks. Under they four to go now as they come up on second down. Here's a play fake as they set up to throw. Flush to his right. He finds his target, Allen. And it's going to be another first down as they'll get into the clean here for first and ten. Herbert powering up the middle. And yeah, nothing doing. He's immediately yeah, taken that's down. that's what their job is. And really, a lot of the time, they have to throttle back a little bit in the run game because you know those defensive end. That's tomorrow. He's got it. Touchdown, Bears. A great play there. With his second TD of the game, his sixth on the year. Points here, Charles, given what we're looking at on the scoreboard, but they've scored on three consecutive possessions, three consecutive drives, and I'm sure that they would like to. Right, but now people continue to accelerate, but we'll see what they decide to do as they come out for this one. But the way this game is gone, they've got to be awfully happy. We'll take a peek, and we'll take a break. On first and ten, it's Herbert. And taking it to the 15-yard line before he's been. What we're watching now is a defense mentally giving in and sagging a little bit. Because but Charles, a lot of happy faces heading into the tunnel as this one ends, and understandably so. Not only did they get the win, but boy, their offense was on fire in this ball game. And partner, I have no idea what the top speed is of all those high-end sports cars. What's the top gear you can get into? This offense, they certainly were there in this one, huh?